Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to Terra Special. In this video tutorial, we'll be discussing about the attribute table, how to create attribute table, how to edit attribute table, how to delete attribute table. So that is what we are going to discuss. So we'll be fully seeing how to use the attribute table in QGIS. So, so we have uh, previously uh, uh, digitized or uh, created the uh, point data, line data, and polygon data. So we are going to see how to add attribute, how to add attribute field, how to edit it, how to delete it. That is what we are going to see in this video tutorial. So you can see on the top point, uh, you can see here in the layer section. So first we begin with the point data. So right click on it and you can find the option open attribute table. So if you by clicking this uh, option, the attribute table will be open. So this is the attribute table as you can see here. So these are the information about the points. For example, let me click over here and uh, let me see whether this field has been highlighted. Yes, the field you can see when you are clicking in the attribute table the point will be highlighted in the map as well so that you can come to know which which of the point has been selected so likewise so for example if we uh, if i click on the second option you can find that it has been uh, the point over here has been selected and you can find the information about this point in the attribute table so attribute uh, uh, attribute table conveys the information about a point or line or polygon so which is uh, essential for us to understand what it is trying to represent so here this point represents the eye hospital so let us begin with it you can just uh, see on the top by just double click double clicking on the id you can sort this field for example, you can sort it from 9 to 0 or you can sort it from 0 to 9. Likewise, you can sort by distance also. You can see from smaller to greater by double clicking on the top, you can change it. Let me bring back it to the previous position. So the entire uh, thing has been selected. So next we see how to edit fields in QGIS. In order to edit any sort of field in QGIS, we need to enable this toggle editing mode so that we can edit the data. So as you can see here, uh, here you can uh, after uh, enabling it, I can uh, easily edit the edit the fields. For example, if you want to put uh, hospital only if you want to put hospital you can remove the eye and put it as hospital or you can create or you can customize it hospital you can give the location name so i'm just giving the location name for it hospital tonde like likewise you can edit you can edit the distance field so here it is uh, saying it is 6 you can edit it for uh, it, it can be a 5 or 5.5 or 4.5 anything like that so you can edit the fields in QGIS so next we see how to create and delete field in QGIS in order to create field, you can find the option new field over here. Select a new field. Here you can give the name for the field. For example, let me give the location name for it. So location. If you want, you can add some comments over here. And you can see, uh, you can select the type of the field. I am going to give, I am going to select text and my text length I can restrict to any number so in this case I'll be putting it to 25 or greater than that so hit the button ok so you can see here the field has been created 
So under location, you can see the field has been created. Now you can uh, put the location. For example, the first is uh, first is a college. So that is located in Chennai. And you can see the next one. So that is uh, that is located in the place name. So they are paid. Second, you can see the bus stand over here. So let me select this uh, and switch on. It has been highlighted. You can see this place name is called as Thiru Votriu. So likewise, you can create uh, fields. And let me show you some more. So I have selected that location. You can see. So this is the lake. Let me go back to the attribute table. Here I can uh, give it, give a name, Mathur. So likewise, you can uh, add a field and you can uh, edit the field over here. So likewise, you can add field. So we're going to next uh, add a, add or delete this field. So we have added a field. Now let us see how to delete the field. So before that, let me save this. Now I'm going to delete a field. So if you select delete field, you can see here, you can uh, select multiple fields at a time and you can delete the field. So it is very useful when you are dealing with a large number of fields, for example, 50, 50 to 60. Uh, that time it, it will be very 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 useful for you so that so that is the usefulness of this uh, uh, QGIS you can uh, delete the field individually for example if I want to delete this location click OK automatically it will be deleted so likewise you can uh, do so let me stop by clicking over here let me stop it and it's asking me to whether save or to discard so I'll be giving this discard likewise you can do so next is let me show you another example once again we need to uh, uh, use the toggle editing mode in order to do any kind of uh, update in the attribute table so uh, next we'll be looking at the types of field which is available in QGIS. Once again, click on the new field. Here you can see field name, comment, and type is available. Here you can use a whole number or a whole number with 64 bit. If you want it in decimal, you can use the decimal numbers. You can use text where you can give name or uh, any uh, symbol, symbols, etc., or whatever can be given in the text. And finally, we have a field for date. So these are the fields which are available in QGIS. So next we see how to save the changes in attribute table successfully. So let me click on this file, the junction. Let me select this file and see where it is located in the map. So you can see here it is a junction and I need to specify the location name so this is the location name of the point data. So now in order to select your edits successfully, once you have finished it, click on the empty space and you can see the option save edits so that your edited, edited uh, your uh, updation or uh, the saved uh, information will be, sorry, the typed information will be saved successfully. You can also delete the field by selecting by selecting like this. You can directly delete the field, delete the selected field. Like as you can see over here, I have directed, deleted the selected fields. So now let me stop it and select the button discard. So this is a method for deleting field. So the next thing is that let me let me show you how to 
copy the field to clipboard easily so once again just click on the toggle editing mode and here you can find the option uh, for example copy the selected rows to clipboard so I have for example let me show you I want to copy this uh, I want to copy this uh, fields now I have selected it now select the option copy selected rows to the clipboard and uh, let me open a notepad and you can see I am just pasting this pasting it over here you can find the information about this field you can see ID, name, distance, location you can find this information we can easily copy it to the clipboard so likewise you can do so if you have any doubts in this please do ask in the comment section I will be answering to your questions thanks for watching Terra Special goodbye everyone